All right, thanks for watching and welcome to Dr. Payam's crazy special where I truly lost my mind. Today, I will find some solutions of F prime equals F. And I'm not claiming those are all the solutions, but I found two very interesting ones. Because notice, F prime equals F. It's the same thing as saying F prime equals F times F. And that's the same as F times F prime. So what do we know? We know F prime equals F times F prime. So F prime times one minus F equals zero. And so F prime equals zero or F equals one. So in other words, F is constant or F equals one. But the problem is one is not a solution because one prime is zero, but one times one times one times one, etc. it's one. So that doesn't work. And how about constants? What we want, we want c prime, which is zero, to be c to the infinity. And in particular, if c is between minus one and one, this works. So at least one solution we have, f is any constant between minus one and one is a solution. But then the thing that actually motivates me, motivated me is, I actually found another solution I actually build this video based on that solution because if you know me well, I like the Chen Lu and there's my favorite derivative called the Mona e to the x Lisa. So consider this. So e to the x prime is e to the x. Now, e to the e to the x prime is Chen Lu the outside. So e to the e to the x times the derivative of the inside, which is e to the x. Now, Let's continue. So e to the e to the x prime, that becomes e to the e to the x times, so e, sorry, e to the e to the e to the x times the derivative of this, which is e to the e to the x, times the derivative of this, which is e to the x. So notice, smaller and smaller powers of e to the e to the x. But then I thought, wait a moment, what if you just had an infinite version of this? Then you have e to the e to the da 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 da, e to the x prime. What this gives you, it's a derivative of the outside, e to the e to the blah blah blah, times the derivative of the inside, which is e to the e to the e to the blah blah blah, times the derivative of the inside, which is e to the e to the e to the blah blah blah, etc. etc. And even though those are smaller towers, they're just infinitely many towers. And notice this infinite e to the x tower, it's a solution of our differential equation. Because notice, if f is e to the e to the e to the x, then what we have is f prime equals f times f times f times f times f. In other words, f prime equals all right, if you like this crazy extravaganza and want to see more math, please make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.